Hey guys, what's up? You are here with Amanda, and for today's video, we are going to be doing my back to school clothing haul, and it is huge. Okay, so before we get started, make sure to subscribe down below. It's free. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you are excited for a try on clothing haul. I asked you guys on Instagram if you wanted it to be just a normal clothing haul or a try on clothing haul, and you guys said try on, so that's what I'm doing for you all today. Right now, I'm just gonna film the actual hauling part. Later, I'm gonna film the try on haul. You guys are obviously watching them both together, but yeah, so I'm so excited. I shopped on Shein, Romway, and on Route 21. I got a lot of big bags. I spent about $50 at each place, um, which is kind of a lot, but I mean, bleh. it's not nearly as much as I would have spent if I went to like the mall and bought everything like in person. So yeah, I have tried everything on. Everything fits me. Some things a little bit tight, some things like slightly loose, but I will be fine. I can always fix things if I have to. Um, summer band's coming up, so I might lose a tiny, tiny bit of weight, which will make the one clothing item that doesn't fit me 100% fit me better. Um, the first place we're going to start with, I guess, is Route 21 because I think this is where I got the least amount of stuff. Um, once again, everything's open, so it's not an unboxing haul, but close enough. So the first thing that I got in here were these pair of shoes. So was th were these pair of shoes? This pair of shoes? I don't know. Um, there were two different types that were similar that I was looking into, but I decided to just go with these. So I got the small, which is like a 6'7", so they might be a little big on me because I'm a 5'6", but I mean, we're fine, we're good. I have um, shoes that are this size anyway. Um, once, like, yeah, they're not like name brand shoes, the best shoes, but I really don't care. Like, if you guys saw my last year back to school um, haul, I literally bought shoes from Walmart, and I love those shoes. I still have them now. But yeah, so I got these shoes because I thought they were just a really basic pair of sneakers that you should have. The next thing that I got is this bralette. It's in ivory, not in white, unfortunately, but I can make it work. I thought it was super cute. This was... I don't know, I think it was on sale for $5.99 or something like that. Or $4.99 something, I don't know. Then the next thing that I got, I was kind of sad about because I didn't know it had this printing on the back because a lot of things nowadays are so cute from the front than have that on the back, but like it's cool. Um, it's just white and it has, it's a white baseball kind of jersey top thing. Um, it's not cropped, but you can tell it is a shorter kind of t-shirt. I got it in a medium, which I guess is why it's not that cropped. Then on the back, it just says 1991 in red. Super great quality, super nice. Um, I don't know how much this is, but I don't these have the price on it. Anyway, whatever, I got that. So the next thing I got was one of these tops. I remember seeing a picture of Emma Chamberlain and something similar to this, and just a lot of people. It's like really in right now. They're the tight-fitted, cropped little shirts that are kind of like baseball tees except they're just regular short sleeve shirts so i got this one in a light pink and white it is so cute i love it it's comfortable it's like the softest thing ever like it's literally it's amazing i would rub it on my face but like no because i don't want to get my blush and stuff all over it also i just recently came back from the beach so that's why i'm like tan if you can even tell the difference then the last thing that i got from rue 21 which is probably one of my favorite things besides that shirt i just showed you are this pair, or these pair, this pair, duh, of high-waisted black jeans. So they're in a size 6, which is the only size they had available online, surprisingly. So I was in luck. But they fit really well. They're really nice quality, actually. Um, I like that they're not super stretchy. It feels like denim. So I really like that. My contract just folded. So the next place that we are going to look at is what I got from Shein. So Shein is one of those websites that are typically kind of iffy whenever people want to buy on there just because of sizing and then it takes like forever to ship which these actually came in pretty recent like I think it took two weeks if not less but uh, I did have a measuring tape with me the entire time I was shopping online to measure like my waist and stuff not so much for tops because tops you just size up but for bottoms I was really like I wanted to be super precise because I didn't want to get those and then they not fit me you know like shirts you can always make work but um bottoms and stuff not so much but anyway the first thing that I got from here was another pair of shoes however I do have to buy um, laces for them because they didn't come with laces they are another pair of sneakers and they look like this I thought they were super cute I like how they're like the bulky kind of shoe so it's white and it has a cute little like heart and then a star then these are just super cute sneakers to have um, one thing like I said I need to get some laces for them so they're shoe set Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Okay, never mind. 
it comes with laces. But I did get a European 37, and I wear a six in women's, like in US sizing, or like a five and a half. So I haven't tried them on, but I know they're gonna fit me. And I can see right now that the sole, like not the sole, what is this thing called? I don't know, the thing at the bottom is like lifting, but that's not really ever an issue for me. If anything, I can like hot glue it down, because like why not? So the next thing that I got in here is this top. Um, once again for the tops, I got, I think I actually got true to size. Like I typically wear a medium, so I got a medium, but I actually fit into a small. It's just I prefer to have bigger size shirts. So yeah, I just got a medium. This one is a white crop top with cute cacti, cactuses, cacti. Um, anyway, I, th I thought it was super cute. And I had like an outfit in my mind when I bought this, which I will show you guys what I bought to go with it next but yeah so I love this I love this shirt super great quality and believe it or not the white shirts that I got actually aren't that see-through so well, probably not even see-through at all actually so what I got to go with that shirt oh my god I love these I'm in love with them they're like okay they're these pants they feel like corduroy material but they're not as thick so that's good right now I have them rolled up because your girl's short I'm five foot so uh yeah. Anyway, I got these in a medium. These are the only pants that I didn't go a size up with because I figured since I had a bunch of elastic, I should be fine. My butt is not that big, so it went over perfectly. The pockets in the back are kind of fake, or they are fake, but it has um, pockets in the front. These are the most comfortable pants I have ever gotten. I love them with all my heart. I can wear them with multiple things that I bought, which I'm so excited for. I just wanted a pair of like cool, funky pants because I only ever wear jeans which is nothing wrong with that I just decided to try something new this year so the next thing that I got is this black top so it looks like this I got the same one in pink let me go ahead and get it out right now so I can compare the two so this is the one in pink they're not turtleneck but it is a higher neck I want to say that the black one is actually higher than the pink however the only downside is that the black one is a different material like if you look at it it doesn't have as much stretch as the pink one does and because of that when I put it on my head not only do I have to take my glasses off but I feel like I'm suffocating for a little bit because it takes a while to get down my head and my head is not that big so I don't know but they're not cropped which I love about them they fit perfectly I love that they're um, more on the fitted side which I typically would stray away from but now I like love it so the next thing that I got from Shein I love this shirt when I tried it on it was a little poofier on the sleeves which you guys will see duh because like it's a try on haul but it looks like this it is red white and navy blue and I love it so much it's v-neck both on the front and on the back and it just gives like the prettiest effect I just love it so much like I said it is a little more boxy but like that's fine because I love it so so much so I can wear with those black jeans that I bought or just blue jeans you know whatever I decide to pair it with but it's just the best thing ever this one is a little bit sheer but not really um, and I don't know it's just more on the fancier side I feel and it's a blouse material not so much like a t-shirt then the last thing that I got from Shein I never wear skirts you guys ever but your girl bought a skirt so I actually bought this one in a large I want to say just because of the size of my waist or no I actually got it in an extra large because the size of my waist is not that small but the way like the chart was is I didn't feel like the ratios were like like I don't think they made sense like the jump from waist size was so weird so it's like I could risk it and have gone with the large but I was like no I'm gonna get the extra large even though it was a couple centimeters over my waist size if that makes any sense at all but I decided to get it anyway it looks kind of big but I promise you it literally fits like it just sits perfectly on my body which you guys will see um, I'm not oops I'm not a big skirt wearer so it is a little bit out of my comfort zone but I'm fine with it a little disclaimer or like not disclaimer I don't know what to say but it is a little bit itchy around it so if I do wear this skirt I'm gonna tuck why I'm gonna wear it but when I wear it I'm gonna go ahead and tuck whatever I'm wearing inside of it so we're barely at like 11 minutes in this haul and I actually thought it was gonna be longer because if anything when I edit it it's gonna get shorter than 11 minutes but to me I was like oh my god I'm getting so many clothes but it's literally not even that long but it's also probably because one I'm talking fast two I'm not really describing everything since the try ons like right here and I'm just showing you what I bought so uh, that's kind of disappointing a little bit, but I'm still in love with like everything I got. So, mm -hmm. 
So now on to Romway, which was the last place that I shopped at. So the first thing that I got, which is the biggest thing and I think the most expensive. Okay, well let me explain this. So there was a different denim dress that I wanted to get. That was an entire one piece spaghetti strap denim dress. Oh my god, you guys, it was the cutest thing ever. But when I went to go check out, they actually sold out of it. So I had to find a different one. More of an overall type dress. I think I put the little sleeve things on wrong, but like whatever, okay? Um, so it clips from the front, which I really, really like because if you want to have that cool like edgy look, you can literally take one off and have it drop in the front, which I love. And it has pockets, but I like that it also has the pocket on the front so your girl can put her phone right here whenever I don't feel like holding it. But yeah, so then the buttons are here on the side and there's like two buttons that you can go with. And I got a size medium. So you look at the skirt right now, look, let me show you. You look at it right now and it looks super, super big. But once you, like, I was like, oh, it's gonna be so big. Like, let me clip this second button on both sides. Girl, I clipped it on one side and when I went over here, I didn't even wanna close. Like, I had to literally go on the first button. If not, it just wouldn't have worked for me. So yeah, that was that. Once again, just get a measuring tape the whole time you're shopping. The next thing that I got is super small, which I'll just show you guys right now. It is one of those necklaces that are black string with a pearl that have been super trendy lately. I wasn't even gonna haul this and I was just gonna go ahead and put it on, so yeah, because like I wanted to wear it now. Like everything else, I'm gonna wait. I think it was advertised as a choker, which makes sense because it's kind of little. This is so cute. Am I trendy now? Like do I look like a surfer boy? Like I am literally obsessed. I'm never taking this off now, so. Mm -hmm. So the next thing I got, this is one of my favorite things ever. It is a solid white shirt with a rainbow stripe across it. So this is in a medium. Um, this is a super trendy shirt that literally everyone has and I loved it so much. I just had to get it. This is like a ribbon across the top. So if it ever does start to fall off, you can just sew it right back on, which I thought was pretty convenient. Um, but yeah, it's super, super soft. It's not that super it's not that see-through believe it or not which is amazing once again so the next shirt that I got is this how do you even explain it it's like a dull pastel seafoam green type thing literally the color that's coming on my camera is the same color it is in person so you guys tell me what you think it is anyway it has this super super cute like mountain skyline thing with a little house and stuff I just thought it was a amazing they had different types of shirts or like they had the same style of shirt but different types of like pocket designs which I thought was super super cool but I decided to go with this one it is like running right here so I gotta figure that out and make sure my hem doesn't fall off but um, it should be fine. I should be able to cut it and then it should be okay. So the next shirt that I got I absolutely love because if you guys don't know, I do own two dogs, a guinea pig, a hedgehog, and fish. Um, and I do have a second fish tank which is actually going to my school if you have not seen that video yet. But I do have several animals. And because of that, I saw this shirt and I fell in love with it. It is solid black and it has one of those little heart things that you see on like a heart monitor. And it also has the outline of a heart and a dog paw or cat paw, whatever you guys want it to be. And I thought it was the cutest thing ever. That's why I had to like pick it up. I was like, I cannot not get that. Like, how does someone leave that behind? I don't get it. So the next shirt that I got, I got it because I love Marla Catherine and I love her style and I just love her. She's beautiful. She has a shirt with this pattern on it and a lot of people always ask her where it's from. So she did once say where it was from, but I don't remember. But I found it on Romway. So I decided to get it on there. It is this sky blue color. It is the length of a regular t-shirt. And it has the wave design that she has on her wall. And I just love it so much. It's so beautiful. And it's just precious. Like, I feel like this is going to be one of my favorite shirts ever. Like, literally ever. So I'm excited for this. Like, wow. Once again, it's in the medium. So the last thing that I got from Romney. One of my favorite things that I got here. Which is also the item that does not fit me 100% perfectly but I still still love it so gingham is a super super popular pattern that's in right now and at first I was going to get like a pair of gingham slacks it was just like regular slacks you know but the sizing was so weird because there weren't any options of sizing it was like you just had to add it into your cart so I was like well, what how would how is that even gonna work but then I found this pair and I just Fell in love the moment I saw it. However, it is going to be a little bit harder to style because of the waistline. 
Um, anyway, it, they look like this. They are pants. At the bottom, they have this cute like ruching type of thing on both sides. And around the waist, it has this cute ruching both on the top and bottom. So I love it so much. I love them. They're actually super, super comfortable. They make my butt look nice. And I don't know. I just love them with all my heart. I feel like they would match with a lot of the things that I bought. Anyways, you guys, that was all for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. Once again, everything was from either Shein, Romway, or Rue 21. They were very inexpensive stores, and I just appreciate them so much because... They have the best clothing. They're always on trend. Yes, they may take a while to ship, but if you guys don't start school until September or like late August like I do myself, you can go ahead and order them like now and then you should be fine, you know? And my plan is to wait like the first week to even break out these clothes because after the first week is when everyone's done wearing their bougie new outfits. So, you know, that's when I'm going to be like, hey, I'm back, you know? Like that kind of thing. Anyway whatever make sure you subscribe once again down below and leave a comment down below if you're excited to go back to school or when you do go back to school because this is the first and probably one of the only videos in my back to school series unless you guys want to see any particular videos and leave a comment down below so i know that you guys want to see that but yeah so i love you guys all all my social medias are down below i just want to stress real quick that i did make a new instagram however it is under the same username so if you think that you're already following me you're probably not so make sure to go ahead and hit the link down below or just look up the Amanda Joel on Instagram and follow me on there. But yeah, so I love you guys all and I'll talk to you guys later.